Hello and welcome to a series based around the Mini, the Austin Morris range and, as we have in front of us, the SU carburetor. Now this is an SU HS4 carburetor, uh, it was fitted to the majority of the Minis and we're just going to run through some of the basic uh, parts of the carburetor and a few of the adjustments you have on it. Okay, so let's get started. Right. So, here we go. On the top, we have the air inlet. Now, this is where your air filter would bolt onto. Uh, you're going to have air rushing down into the throat of this carburetor, and it's going to move into the throttle body, which is this section of the carburetor. Now, on top, we have the dash pot containing the piston. Uh, on this side, We have the float chamber, uh, we have the fuel inlet, we have the breather pipe. We also have a vacuum pipe connector here, which is would go from here, between here and the distributor. Moving around again, here we have the location where your throttle cable will connect, which will actuate the butterfly. Next to this, we have the choke lever, which actuates the fuel jet at the bottom, as you can see it moving down. We have um, an idle screw adjustment here, which you would adjust either in, screw it down in to increase the idle speed, you would unscrew it to reduce the idle speed, and similar here, we have the fast idle screw. This functions against the choke leave a cam here, so again screw it in to increase the speed, screw it out to reduce the fast idle speed. Finally, down below here we have the mixture adjusting screw. Now you would unscrew this, screw it down uh, to uh, richen the mixture, so we're going to reduce, uh, richen the mixture, so increase the amount of fuel going in each time, or if we screw it back in towards the top of the carburetor body, we're going to be reducing the amount of fuel going in, also leaning the mixture off. Okay.